This is Nirguna giving you your full moon for August uh, astrology report. This is it's been an interesting time. We've just come through something called the Lion's Gate, the Leo time, the Lion's Gate. It's when Sirius in uh, Egypt rises having been behind the sun and the pyramids are aligned to that and it's a great kind of rejoicing time when uh, when the Sirius starts to rise, which in esoteric astrology is, is, is the third eye energy, the more insightful energy. So this full moon is along the Leo and Aquarius axis. The sun is in Leo, the moon is in Aquarius. And the sun is there with a group of very nice planets. Venus, your your sense of harmony and beauty. Mars, how you put that in action. And Mercury, how you can communicate that. All around this liony, Leo-y, showy energy of of uh, of the high summer, you know. So it's time for a performance here. This is a very bright time compared to the the last full moons, you know, put on your show, dress up, fall in love, go out and be extravagant with yourself. This is Leo energy is to put on the show. Of course, the moon is opposite this, which creates a tension, and it's in Aquarius. And that says to be detached. So there we have the two stories. Putting on a show in a detached way, not being a not being uh, compelled to have judgments about what you're doing or, or being down on yourself. So it's a bright full moon.